Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, it's been a minute, it's been a hot minute. Um, I took a break, as you guys know. Um, Happy New Year! Have you guys been? Um, believe it or not, I'm actually very excited. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just taking it, um, being back on here. I'm taking it in. As you guys know, last year was long. Um, I moved to the UK. I started YouTube in August, and you know, I was posting twice a week and nine times a month. It was, it was exhausting, but I really enjoyed posting. I really enjoyed you know meeting up with the deadlines and not missing a single day that was giving me the ginger to even do more um so much so that even at times when i would have class in the morning at 9 a.m i would film at midnight edit at midnight into the morning of when i have class sometimes i'm still editing in class if you follow me on instagram and insta stories you would see um the behind the scenes of it all sometimes i'm editing in the middle of class just so I can meet up with the posting time, I mean, upload time and all of those things. Um, I really liked it, even though it was hectic and I really loved it. But when it came to December, I just knew that I needed to catch a break. Um, I could have gone, but I knew that I needed that break because I didn't want to get to the point where the, where like YouTube would become like work for me. Um, and I wouldn't be enjoying it as much cause then I wouldn't just want to do it anymore. So I just told myself, you know what you've tried and you deserve a break take it um so i did that um and so for the most part in december i didn't even vlog at all because i was working or i was home and i just so yes um it's a new year now and last year if you guys watched my last vlog um some one of the vlogs i posted in december there was a bit where we went for this exercise of like cleansing you know just things you want to let go of in 2022 and i went for that thing because i was just I needed a way out. If you guys watched my vlogs last year, you would have seen at some point I was struggling with so many things, adjusting. A lot of things were happening at once. And I was just like, you know what, whether or not it's true or not, I'm just going to go for this thing. I just need to believe something is coming, like something is going to work out. So I did that. And for some reason, ever since then, yeah, I've just, I've just had this light like i've just been so positive ever since i've been so optimistic when this new year was starting out i was like bro nothing is going to flop in my this year i'm at the point where i'm like everything is going to work out for me um and i believe so much in that now i'm just so positive these days and i really like it um it's kind of part of what i wanted to talk about with the whole like reset recap type thing i didn't want to make the video too long i just wanted to come say hello kind of like just um make myself make a video to post and then know that i've already started so there's no going back i contemplated posting this video 20 million times even though i have about like 30 more things in content to put up um this is gonna be great we're gonna do so much on youtube this is also my graduation year it's also the year of dissertation this is the year that i hit like a thousand on on youtube because we're currently at 6 30 now which is great like that's so good i'm so happy and i'm so like thankful for you guys just this year i just wanted to try things differently some of the things that i've started to do now is um i've started a couple habits um i've also started to write a lot in terms of like things i'm that i'm appreciative of um i'm also starting to journal and like manifest things and just hope for the best in that sense because what's the harm in trying um you know i also did my vision board this year um it was great i made it like on i think it's on my laptop but it's on my phone as well it's on my pinterest it's everywhere um i just did it and then my goal is to just do it have it somewhere and then work towards all of those goals i love how like it just makes me feel ginger to want to do more um, and walk towards the goals that I've written. I also well. noticed that last year during like all the times when I was having troubles and everything, I was very like, I was feeling so upset and angry and frustrated. I was even like, I think I was even feeling very, very ungrateful, which is why, let me show you guys. So I did this thing. I've seen them before, but I never really knew. Also, I kind of didn't have a way to put it. So, um, which is funny. I didn't have where to put it. So I found this box. 
with like some of the suits I bought last year. So I put them out and I put it which and the name is celebrations. But what I'm using this for is I'm writing, you know, every good thing that happens to me every day that I'm grateful for. And I just write it and put it in here so that on days when I'm feeling funny and I'm starting to feel one way, um, I can refer back to it. And it might not even be on a random day. It may just be even at the end of the year when I want to think about all the good things that have happened to me this year. And I just think that it's a really cute way of like keeping track and being like accountable for, I guess, your feelings in that sense um and it's one of the reasons why i really like manifestations as well because like in order for you to be able to manifest things to happen to you you want good things to happen to you so you want your head and your heart and your soul and your mind to be in a positive space and that's kind of what manifestation does for you it kind of forces you to always be positive and not not in a negative way and not in a like in a pushy way but because you know you're expecting something good you always want to be optimistic and i think that that's good for me at least because I tend to dwell on what's not doing great and forget what's, what's been working out fine for me. So I just needed some sort of push um, to be more positive. And I've been doing that um, with the journaling. I just got a book to journal with. Um, I, will, I will get the prompt in future and all of those like cute book thingies that they use for it. But I'm easing myself slowly into it. I'm more relaxed now. Um, you know, I've also written out some of the habits. Oh, by the way, that's all you guys. I took some like, I can't see. I'm not wearing my glasses. But um, somewhere in school, they were handing out like, they were doing like a fair thing. So I went and I just wanted to, this year I just wanted to try different things, you know. Um, and I just told myself that I'm not going to do, I'm not going to make this year the way last year was. I'm going to be doing more things. I'm going to be more active with life. And things in general so i went to school and they were doing this thing where they were handing out these fitness classes things um so i want to take yoga classes or like even pilates and like the gym you know all of those healthy things i want to try to do those things this year no pressure no pressure because again what's the harm in trying um there's nothing that has come out i mean you know there's so much more that could come out of trying just moving out of your bed and it's even advisable for you to exercise every once in a while so I'm working towards doing all of those things of really taking you guys along, obviously, because it will be in vlogs and you guys are going to see. So I just took a couple of flyers for like societies to join and like groups to be in. I just want to explore a lot. They I had other things set up as well, like different um, tables for different things, different clubs, arts and craft, um, different things like that. Um, so I, I saw this like Muslim society one and they gave me a free Quran. I think I posted it on my Instagram, which was really cute. It was free. And I got the English translation one. So that's the one I'm going to be reading through. Um, but yeah, I've just so far, the year has been great, you know. This year, I also want to do my Instagram and kind of grow it. I had a conversation with the people on my close friends. And we we're just talking about how, kind, like, the kind of dilemma I'm in with Instagram. But I've just said that, you know what, this year, nothing is going to stress me out. Like, I'm, I'm not built for stress this year. Like, at first, it was trying to, it was getting me down. But I'm like, do you realize this is just January? This is just halfway through January and you're already getting stressed. I think go for beats. Okay. Um, I'm not gonna let Instagram push me anyhow. So I just found a way around. But also, even with the content that is coming on YouTube, I'm excited for that. You guys loved the ones that my friends were on. Um, you they want to do more. Some of you guys even messaged me asking to make it a thing, so it's going to be a thing. Um, our timetables and schedules are really squeezed together this year. It's been long, even that's why it's one of the reasons why I haven't been able to find how to make my YouTube thing work. Cause last year I had classes Thursdays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Thursdays. Um, so I was free from Friday to Monday, but now I have classes Mondays, Thursday and Fridays. I'm only free on Wednesday and Tuesday and Wednesday and on the weekends. So the timetable is, a, is upside down now. Um, and so we're just trying to see how we can work it out. I do have some things ready for um conversations with my friends that we can talk about on youtube so you know look forward to that i also kind of want to explore girl chats in a sense because i've always wanted to do like um a tv show or something like that on tv where there's a section for girl chat where we just talk about all things girly and you know growing and stuff like that but i mean technically youtube is tv so why not do it now um it just came to my head like last year when i was planning all this content i was like you know what why not just do it on, on youtube because technically youtube is tv so you start from somewhere um so there's a lot more 
coming up with girl chat related stuff i also want to really really explore fashion this year because my niche used to be beauty fashion and lifestyle and i noticed that my beauty in the sense that i was talking about i meant my personal beauty i wasn't doing beauty like the way beauty gurus would be doing like beauty transitions doing everything on camera no i meant my personal beauty but then and i figured that that just just me you know it's not my niche it's just my personal interest that kind of thing so it's now fashion and lifestyle okay period stop there <laughs> nothing more um so yeah i just want to explore that a lot this year i want to you know do bigger things <laughs> mature things i don't want to speak too much on it so i don't like them backtrack and not do it but um you know i just wanted to give you guys kind of an update on what to look forward to where i've been all of that stuff ah <sighs> but now that i have also can you guys tell i'm using my snapchat camera to record this video um you guys pray for me oh, may i buy a camera this year because <laughs> you know it is what it is but yeah i'm just kind of exploring and how to make my content really better um in terms of like quality and all i hope that this is doing fine uh so yeah if you are i forgot to mention earlier because i was just like i was ready to just dump right in but if you're seeing me for the very first time hi my name is ore i'm a content creator and youtuber um if you've enjoyed this video so far please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and stick around and watch my other videos from last year this is going to be the beginning of a new era i'm excited um there's so much i want to show you guys i kept on so many things to share this year like when i wasn't doing anything my friend was saying oh maybe i could just start the year with like a december vlog i said what's that because <laughs> the day i dropped my my thing my phone and said i'm not posting nothing else again i'm gonna break that was the last time i i took my phone from this to this to film anything because you know I, I was just done like i was like mm. But the thing is, if I had a camera here, I would have probably been filming on that. My phone is the one place where I do everything and where everything is. I, um, my phone is where I'm doing my assignments. I'm filming things that I use for TikTok, for Instagram pictures. I'm also filming YouTube content on my phone. This phone should just not die on me. Like, I, I sometimes I just look at it and I'm like, I'm so sorry. Okay, I apologize. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm just, you know managing it in that sense but you know i mean it's, it's back now back to business back to everything <laughs> um back to work back to school back to all of that so i wanted to just come in and just kind of kind of share things with you guys um i also wanted to recommend that if you just struggle with putting your thoughts together and stuff you can try journaling just write things down um uh, you know start with things you're grateful for so it makes you feel optimistic from the start like when you when you think about things that you're grateful for if you just think that you struggle with putting your thoughts together or you just feel like you you want to put everything in perspective because when you have it written down it's just it just comes together that way um i think you should just try journaling you can just pick up a book i have a, have a different book that you used to do it and just write down things that you're thankful for and just i guess be appreciative it's not too late to do your vision board if you don't have one yet i just feel like a vision board kind of helps you to set things in place to just kind of know what you're looking forward to this year and just know what your goals are going to be having all of your thought in one place you just put your vision board together and just forget about it and then just focus on getting things done um so yeah i just wanted to come on youtube and just come say hello and say happy new year um i'm just gonna set the tone for the year to be honest because i'm like <laughs> like why not um so yeah um i hope i'm not forgetting anything but if i am you guys will find out in, in the other videos um i got a lot of things over the break over the christmas into new year break period and i want to share with you guys but you guys will find them in the next content that's coming up um i'm super excited um but yeah i just wanted to pop in come say hello and then we can take it from here no pressure at all on this side no pressure okay um if you haven't subscribed to my channel already please do that click the subscribe button below and just you know join the fam watch my other videos and um i will see you guys in my next one bye